Gretchen Goldman also uh, joins us now. She's a research, she's the research director at the Unit of Concerned Scientists. You know, working from home became this new um, reality, uh, but what's on screen is not always what the reality is. Uh, Dr. Gretchen Goldman uh, took to Twitter to share two photos about being honest about the reality of working home, and that just went viral. Gretchen Goldman, uh, you're a scientist. You were on a new show to talk about the future of America's federal climate change leadership. What were these two pictures you posted? What were they showing? Please talk us through that. And why do you think it resonated with women all over the world? I had a, a TV bit that I had uh, 45 minutes to prepare for, and uh, I quickly put together a, a scene that I thought would be a, a good background, different than this background. Same and, jacket, though. Uh, and yeah, yes, I never put on this jacket, but I wanted to make sure I wanted to show, be honest about the situation that I was in, which was this other photo where I have a chair on a table and I'm surrounded by toys. Um, because that's the reality that I and, and many other moms and other parents and caregivers are facing during this pandemic. Hmm. And, uh, you know, um, while, of course, it's touched a chord, many women responded. Uh, you, you got a lot of uh, congratulations about how you were handling the situation. But is there, does this also give away the fact that there is a lot of mental stress on women? This is a high-powered, uh, high, uh, high-stress job. You're on national TV for an interview but you have your kids running around yeah absolutely it's 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 an it's we're being given an impossible task this is just very infeasible for uh women to be able to be caregivers to their kids all day while maintaining jobs and that's true of, of many people who are caregivers yeah. now but it disproportionately falls to women that's right uh, and that's why uh, my kids are down there now, which is why I can't use that better background. <laughs> and uh, it's been very uh, challenging. And I think we need to be honest about that and, and demand more of decision makers that's, so that we aren't living under this. That's right. And studies show that work from home in India certainly is disproportionately stressing out mothers. Professor Ashwini Deshpande, uh, with India under lockdown, schools and colleges clothes running or running online, Families are buckling under this child giving burden. When families struggle with child giving burden, is it the lower wage earner that normally leaves the workforce and would that usually be a woman? So it's a mixed uh, situation. One of the things that has emerged in the recovery phase, so my early results were already summarized by Namita, which is that conditional on being previously employed, yeah. Women were more likely to have left the uh, workforce or were unemployed in April 2020. Yeah. And so even though more men lost jobs, uh, uh, relatively speaking, the loss of employment for women was greater. Hmm. Now, after April, May, June, July and August, uh, employment is going up. And the interesting fact about the uh, recovery phase is that the highly educated women, that is women with postgraduate and uh, higher levels of education, who actually suffered the least amount of employment loss in April, uh, by August, they are less likely to be in the la labor force. And uh, this is what the data are showing. And my guess is that it's uh, getting more and more difficult for women to manage work from home, yeah. childcare responsibilities with yeah. schools being closed etc yeah. and so uh, the issue that you uh, just were discussing with uh, with mothers actually seems to be borne out by uh, data